Now regarding this new type of uh, malicious document, so a PDF file that uh, contains a Word document, an embedded Word document, which has uh, macros. Uh, a couple of people have asked me how, how this actually behaves. Uh, I, when you open it uh, with Adobe Reader, uh, how it uh, behaves. So I'm going to do this here in a, in a virtual machine. Here I have uh, the malicious uh, sample. So you open it and then you can see here you have the taskbar and uh, menu from Adobe Reader, but, but the rest of the page is not uh, rendered. Uh, you still see the underlying desktop, but you have here an opened file menu. Um, the file 5.doc will be saved to a temporary file and then opened. So uh, Word will be launched to open the file when you click on OK. So let's uh, do this. OK, yeah, and you see here Word was launched and here we have the macros, but the macros are disabled here uh, in this case so they don't run automatically but uh, we can have a look here in uh, developer visual basic here you can see uh, the macros for example here this module here this uh, one contains the uh, obfuscated uh, urls so that is uh, how it works the reason why uh, it works like that is because of uh, JavaScript inside the PDF. So there is JavaScript inside this PDF that launches this dialog. Okay. Now if you cancel here, you just get the PDF and uh, the embedded file was not saved, but you can have a look here by clicking here uh, on the paperclip. And then you see the files that have been embedded here, 5.doc, the embedded file and you can save it from here or even open it from here. Now we are not uh, going to do this. So it was because of JavaScript that this uh, save and open dialog uh, appears automatically. So let's have a look here. Okay, so this is my template that I designed for uh, 010 uh, editor. Here you have the object with the JavaScript. Yeah. Object three is uh, the JavaScript. And if you take a look here, you see this dot export the data object, a name and a launch. And this is actually the instruction that will launch a dialog and uh, open um, the Word document when the user says, okay, two, uh, so and launch two, uh, instructs the export data object function to save to a temporary file and then open it. If you change this here, for example, in zero, then a dialog will appear to save the file, but this file will not be opened automatically. So I can show you this. So I just modified the sample. Let me open it here. And now you see we have a dialog to save we can save this but uh, nothing is actually opened automatically 